how to demonstrate the, the out of plane technique, which I think most people will find easier than the in plane. Um, really important how you hold the probe. So holding the probe nice and low, I've got my little finger anchored on the skin so I can hold the probe just hovering over the surface of the skin, barely touching it. Um, I'm sitting so that my needle and the probe and the ultrasound machine are in line with each other and you can see I've got a vessel right in the center of the screen there um, which is collapsing when I push on it. I'm just going to ensure I know which side of the probe is which um, which I do. So I'm going to the key to this technique is following the tip of the needle um, into the vessel. So I'm going to look at the probe and the needle I'm going to insert the needle into the, into the skin and then I'm going to angle the probe towards the needle and I'm going to slide the probe back up towards the needle until I find the very tip of the needle. The first part of the needle is appearing on the screen and you can see that's just appearing right at the top of the screen there but it's not completely in line with the vessel so I'm going to come back a little bit and just move my insertion point slightly. Okay, again, um, I'm scanning back until I see the tip of the needle, which you can see just there. You can see there it is, and now it's gone. So I know that's the tip. So I'm going to follow that. Um, if you look at the at the screen, I'm just I'm going to advance on the tip, advance on the tip. Still maintaining a little light pressure on the vessel on the curve. So you can see the tip is the tip now. I can see in the in the lumen of the vessel. And I'm going to flatten out. And I'm continuing to follow up inside the vessel. There you can see that's the lumen of the vessel, the tip is right in the center, and we have the cannula in the ring.